After a year of planning, hours on hours of practice, and nearly half of Freed Hardeman's student body involved, the music is back. This weekend is the university's 38th annual Make and Music competition. WBBJ 7 Eyewitness News reporter Katie Shambo takes us there. It's that time of year again in Henderson when alumni come back to campus to watch the students showcase their hard work they've put in all year. Now to see a year's worth of work come together into one weekend is just, it's heavy, you know, it comes on you, it's big. Around 600 students make the performance possible. It's kind of a variety show. Uh, we have six social clubs and they compete for the Sweet Six trophy. They get judged on, on each show, each performance. Tony Allen has been the show's producer for nine years and says the weekend of performances brings in around 8,000 people. To me, it's about the process. It's not about this weekend. It's about the whole year-long process of uh, working on something together and building relationships. Those involved would agree it's about more than the competition. It's just been a big opportunity to be together, to grow together with people, and that's mm -hmm. kind of what it's all about. As competitive Amen. as it does get, it's just great to meet and know people. Making Music was started by the class of 78. Alumni say they hoped it would grow, but it has surpassed expectations. It's just so exciting for all the alumni to come back, and now our children are in the show, and that's exciting. This is the biggest show on campus, and students say they're sad to see it come to an end. It's a blessing to have an opportunity to give them joy and to give them a way to see God's uh, glory through our, through our talents, so it's a blessing. In Henderson, Katie Shambo, WBBJ7 Eyewitness News. Making music producer Tony Allen says the music never stops. In fact, they will start planning for next year's show starting next week.